much Nina Sky. My legs are so itchy because I shaved them. Does that does that like happen to anyone else? I think it does. You know what I mean? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd do an updated uh, makeup collection tour. What do you call these videos? What are they called? Makeup. Makeup collection. Yeah, video. I did one about a year ago and now I have, I think like I have completely different stuff now. Oh, some will be the same, but like obviously like makeup only lasts like one to two years. Um, so like I've thrown out and like given away a lot. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so before, not that you can see anything, uh, before I show you my makeup, I'd like to show you my makeup mirror. Okay. Okay. Alright, so this is how it looks like, obviously, um, light off. Uh, so it's just got like one button. Uh, and then on the other side, oh my god. On the other side, it is so zoomed up. And also maybe for like your uh, eyeshadow, uh, it would help because it's really like close up. You know what I mean? This is like my little setup. So obviously uh, brushes. I have a range. So I've got like a lot of Morphe brushes. Uh, that's probably majority of them. I've got a Zoeva buffer brush here. I've got some Eco Tools ones like, like this one. What else do I have? I have a Benefit eyebrow brush. I have, this is a MAC angled brush that I have. This, I don't know. Um, you would have seen this brush in my other videos. I love it because of this part. That's about it. Oh, I also have stuff from uh, Chi Chi, such as this one. I used to have other ones, but I think I got rid of them. Yeah. And also in here, I have my eyebrow uh, goof poop. <laughs> this is such a tongue twister the benefit goof proof brow pencil I always stuff that up and over here I just have like a same tin but smaller I want to get different tins uh because I don't know they just remind me of basketball hoops not that basketball is bad like I love playing basketball but I don't know, I just want something a bit cuter. So in here I have this beauty blender from Kiss All About Beauty. I've got a lot of real techniques, um, small and big ones. And then down here, oh, that's beautiful. And a few down here are from Chi Chi Cosmetics. And then I also have one of those, um, oh, what are they called? A silicone, like thin one. I'm not going to get it out, but yeah, it's... I got one of those ones. I don't really use it though. I find it, although it doesn't waste product, it is very hard to work with. Moving over here, this is like the stuff that I like reach for a lot or stuff that I kind of use every day. I use like this and also foundation in my foundation drawer. So we've got this uh, Too Faced Natural Matte Palette because it's got obviously like natural colors and also I use this shade in the top right for my eyebrow so i've got a moisturizer by olay i've got a few mario badescu or D Descu, um sprays that's nearly done that one but that's the uh aloe herbs and rose water i've got this um aloe chamomile and lavender i actually love this one more than this one and also the spritzer on this one is way better than this one and i have no idea why i've got a lip balm that i always reach for which is the burt's bees uh, wild cherry one i've got the glam glow glow setter setting spray so that's nearly done too uh then in here what do i have in here oh i've just got some sample uh primers in here so i've got Sorry. The Too Faced Hangover Primer and also the Hourglass. What's this one called again? Veal Mineral Primer. I've got an eyelash curler from Tarte. I've got a plucker, which is just a manicure one. I've got the MAC Prep and Prime, which I don't use that often because the spritzer on this one's a bit stuffed and it just like leaves spots all over my face but anyway uh then i have a deep sea hydrating mist toner uh this i put this on like after i take my makeup off 
and I'll show you like what width and stuff. So yeah, I've got this. Uh, I really like this. It's just nice to put on and it's like refreshing. Okay, I'm just gonna move like these out of the way. <laughs> um, yeah, even this actually. Excuse me. <laughs> so we have a lot going on in here. Um, I'll start off with like the bigger things. So this is just pore pore ointment, and this is uh, uh the Maybelline Baby Skin for Pores. I've also got this. Dermalogica Clear Start Breakout Clearing Booster so that I put on before I put on my makeup and it's good for like pimples. I've got this Drunk Elephant Oil which is really good for dry skin. It's really expensive. This is a tester that I got from Mecca Land but this is actually so expensive but it's so good like for dry skin uh, and it just makes your makeup go on so much better. I've got two Fit Me Oh, actually, no, I don't. This is a Fit Me um, by Maybelline Concealer. It's a dark shade, so I, like, hardly ever use it. And then this is a Fit Me bottle, obviously. But I put uh, the Maybelline Master Conceal in it because I just... The Maybelline Master Conceal is, like, an applicator, like, in something like this. And it's just hard to work with. Oh, this is my eyebrow serum that I spoke about in my eyebrow tutorial video. Uh, this just helps with like growing your eyebrows back. Uh, the um, lettering has rubbed off and I need to get a new one because this is like basically empty. I have some eyebrow products. So I've got the Gimme Brow uh, uh, setting gel. I've got, this is like my all time fave, the Maybelline Brow Drama one. So that's like another brow gel. Uh, setting gel and then I've got this Maybelline Brow Precise Fiber Filler. My last brow product is by Essence. It's just a lash and brow mascara so you can put it on before uh, mascara but I've actually never done that but it's just a clear gel you can put through your eyebrows and I actually really like it. I don't use it enough and it's really cheap too because by Essence. The last things that I have in this compartment is um, mascaras. So I've got the Maybelline Total Temptations. It's my biggest one because all the other ones are small because I always get the smaller ones. And I've explained in heaps of videos that it's because when I get the big ones, they dry out too quickly. I've got this Ciate Wonder Wand uh, Mascara from Mecca. I've got this Bad Gal Bang by Benefit. I've also got the Roller Lash by Benefit. I've got the tart Tardiest Mascara, I've got the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, and then lastly, I've got, uh, I think it's Per or P-U-R, I'm, I'm not sure how to pronounce this, but it's a fully charged mascara, and this is actually really good, like, I got this in a Bella box, and it's so good. Moving on to these two drawers, uh, so in this drawer, I have two compartments, so... Um, sorry, I just ate a lolly and like I'm still like digesting it. So we'll just take out the tape and the scissors. This side has uh, all of my lipsticks. I won't go through all of them because I've just got like a bit too much, but I'll just say what brands I have in here. So I have a Tarte one. I've got some Revlon ones. I've got some Jeffree Star. I've got a Mecca Max one that I like don't use. I've got some samples in here. Um, these are... What are these? I can't remember actually, I don't, oh my gosh, I actually don't remember what brand, but yeah, they're just some sample ones. I've got, this was like $2 from Chemist Warehouse, it's actually a lip gloss and it's also like a lip plumper, like it's so good, I actually love this, by the brand W7. Got only two, to be honest, I want to get more, but I've only got two at the moment. These two colours like match kind of all of these lipsticks, they don't match like reds, but they match everything else. So these are both by Napoleon Purtis and they're just lip liners. I've got some queen ones, only two though. Uh, so this is also oops, a lipstick queen. This is the green one that goes on like glossy. Uh, also it's got like a tone of pink in it, which is, I think it's really cool. I've got a e.l.f. lip plumper. So I always used to use this and I don't anymore, but it's actually good. Is this a lip plumping side? Yeah, this is a lip plumping. So they have a primer on that side and then an actual, that like stings your lips. It's, but it's good though because it plumps them up. I've just got another uh, lip gloss. This is by Sally Hansen. Oh, I forgot I had this. Oh, fuck. Uh, this is a NYX butter gloss. Yeah, I'll explain what these are in a minute. Oh, also another NYX. This is purple. <laughs> Love it. Uh, this is a MAC uh, lip glass. Lip gloss. They call it glass, but it's lip gloss. 
uh, what else? Oh, and then just a Napoleon Purtis uh, lip uh, stick that actually matches this one. So that's like basically all my lipsticks. And what I've got in here is I've got samples. I've got heaps of samples from Bella Box and Mechaland. So this is a moisturizer. I can't remember what brand, but I've taken a picture of it. This is a, it's clear, like you can't really see it. It's clear in there. It's like for damaged skin. And then this is from a sample from Lush. It's just of the skin drink facial moisturizer. Over here, so this is what I use. It's a soothing facial toner. I use this with cotton pads to take my makeup off. This is a ear sterilizer because my ears get infected uh, a lot. I can't wear earrings anymore because my ears are just really sensitive. Uh, this is a little sample I got of the Bioderma. Uh, what's it called? It's a um, micellar water and it's actually really good. So I kind of do want to get the bigger one. Over here we've just got some facial cleansers that I've got. Uh, we've got uh, the Sand and Sky Australian Pink Clay. This is actually really good. And I also really like this one, the Origins Out of Trouble Mask. Drunk Elephant Cleanser that I got from Mechaland. So these are like all samples that I've got. Over here, this is not really a makeup drawer. <laughs> well, it kind of is, uh, but isn't. Uh, it's kind of like a beauty drawer, I'd say, and hair drawer. So over here, I've just got some water wipes that I got. Uh, it's also kind of like a random drawer. Like, there's just all random stuff in here. Got hair ties, headbands for when I do my makeup, hair brushes. Uh, this is like a detangler, and this one's good for when I straighten my hair, because it keeps my hair straight. I've got the Revlon uh, heat protector that also does, like, heaps of other stuff. Like, it has, like, ten things it does, which are listed here. I've just got some masks back here. So, this is a sleep mask I got, and also a hydrating tissue mask. Then over here, um, some more samples I got. Uh, this is just, like... Uh, paw paw and also like hand creams. Uh, this is also a hand cream that I got uh, in a show bag from the Melbourne show. Because I go to the gym, I get calluses here, so that's really good for that. I've got a spare paw paw cream that I also got in a show bag from the show. I've got a facial um, moisturizer. Then I've also got uh, some hair care products in here by Coco and Eve. And also, I forgot what brand this is, uh, TLW, it's a frizz fighter one. I've just got some, also some, just some little brushes that I don't really use. And I've also got uh, heaps of samples that I got from Mechaland. So I've got another Better Than Sex, another one of these, another one of these, which I really love. I've got another one of these. One of these was in the other drawer. I've got a primer that I've used, the Mecha Max one. I don't really like it. It's the Bring bring on bright one i've got a sample of girl meets pearl by benefit an hourglass highlighter stick it's tiny though uh an urban decay eyeshadow primer and also just oh that's just like a lip balm that i just like don't really use anymore and this is uh a replacement for the eyelash curler from tar moving over here i just have uh these five drawers and also a bigger drawer underneath so in the first drawer i have my powders and highlighters so i have one from mac quite a few from Australis. Uh, these, wait, these two are the same color, but this one was like panning really hard and I should really throw it out. Uh, this is a darker color and the lid's also like broken. I've got the Mary Luminizer highlighter. I've got a Laura Mercier highlighter and also a Laura Mercier uh, the translucent uh, setting powder. In this drawer is my foundation drawer. I have heaps of foundations, I know, but like half of them aren't the right color, so I have to mix some with the other ones. So up the back here, I have uh, the Fit Me by Maybelline. That's too light. I have a Remmel uh, London one that is, what's this called? Lasting Finish, uh, the 25 hour one. And that's good, but it's too dark. <laughs> So these are like my drugstore ones. And then over here I have uh, two Born This Way uh, by Too Faced ones. I've got the Hourglass Vanish uh, stick. I've got the NARS uh, Longwear Radiant Glow. I always forget what this is called. NARS Radiant Longwear Foundation. <laughs> 
that's what it's called. Over here, I have the Master Conceal by Maybelline. This is the one that I put in the little Fit Me bottle that you saw before. I've got the Boing by Benefit one. I don't really like this. It's supposed to be hydrating and... Like, it's not really, uh, but anyway. Also got the newest uh, Born This Way uh, multi-use sculpting concealer. So this is good. This is the same shade as this, but it looks lighter. And I, it, of course it is lighter because it is a concealer. In here, we've got a few different things. So we've got... Um, yeah, we've got quite a few different things in here. I have some eyebrow products. So I have the Cub Brow and the Brow Zings as well as the High Brow by Benefit. I've got Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Pomade. I don't really use it though. <laughs> I've got some eyeliners, so this is a sample of the Stilla one. I've also got like a crayon one by Maybelline and also the Master Precise eyeliner from Maybelline. Oh, this is a Maybelline uh, brow pencil. I don't really like it, but it's actually like a really good drugstore one. So, but obviously I'd rather use the Benefit ones and like I use this every day, the Cabrow. But it is really good for drugstore. So if you're wanting a cheap one, that's actually a really good uh, product. Got a Smashbox. So this is a, an eyeshadow palette. It's not in my eyeshadow drawer because it doesn't fit, but it's an eyeshadow palette. Uh, then we've got some blushes. So I've got a Mecca Max one, an Essence one, and also uh, this is a like three in one. It's supposed to be a or four in one. I don't know. <laughs> it's got a blush, a highlight, a bronzer, and it, these can also all be used as what do you call it eyeshadows. I also have a dandelion blush and the last thing in here is from Appeal Cosmetics and it's highlighter drops. Oh, and also I've got a NYX uh, eyeliner. It's like a glittery silver pencil. In here I've got a the In The Balm Volume 2 by uh, The Balm. <laughs> so this has uh, eyeshadows, blushes and a... Uh, bronzer. I've also got the Contour Spectrum Palette by Zoeva. So that just has ooh, uh, a banana powder highlight and two, uh, what do you call them? Contours. I've got a contour and highlight stick by Maybelline. Don't really like this and I've been meaning to give this away but <laughs> I haven't got around to it. I've got a Physician's Formula bronzer, a Remmel uh, London bronzer, a Sun Shimmer and also a Master Bronze palette by Maybelline which has a highlighter and three different coloured bronzers. And the last drawer in this compartment is my eyeshadow drawer. So I have uh, this one by Too Faced, which is the Life's a Festival palette. I've got the Androgyny palette by Jeffree Star with these colours. And I've got also the Beauty Killer one with these colours. I've got the OMFG Chi Chi palette. Uh, this is just a few like... Uh, papers on like what I looks I can do with some of the palettes I have I've got these Morphe pressed pigments so I've got like a pinky one and a gold one then I have some Stila what are these called again I always forget what they're called liquid yeah glitter and glow liquid eyeshadow so this one's in the shade beauty junkie it's a pink one and this one's like more of like a maroon bronze color uh, and it's the bronzed bell. And in this last big drawer down here, I just have like kind of like some housekeeping things. So I have uh, some wipes. <laughs> I have some cotton pads. These are just some travel containers. Uh, so you would have noticed the two little pots in the right drawer before. They're from this packet. I've got lashes. Uh, that these are. That's one I've already used these before. These are the same ones as these. I got some more. They're just from Wish and they're really cheap. They're $5 for three pairs and they're really nice. These I don't really like. I got them also from Wish and I just don't like the design of them and they look a bit like cheap. This was from, oh, I forgot the brand. Glam Eyes because it has the um, little glue on the back on one of them. So these are the same. These are like a bit dramatic. I can't remember what style they were in. I've got some, oh, I've put them in the wrong way. Some model rock lashes that you would have seen in my latest Bella Box unboxing. I've got like a helper. <laughs> Eyelashes, I never used this though. I've got this mini plucker by Benefit <laughs> that I got with uh, the brow. Uh, what's it called? 
with the browsing so this came in like that and I've just got some glue so this one they're both from Ardell this one's a clear one but it stings my eyes so I never use it and that's why I got this lash grip uh one by Ardell that goes on like white but dries clear I've got the Huda beauty palette but this is the one before they redid it so like I don't really like the pigment on these and stuff like I don't know what to do with it because I don't know whether I want it or not um but hit me up if you want it because I'll literally probably just give it to you over here oh that's just some lash glue and a stick to like put on well it's not a stick it's actually a makeup brush but I use the end of it to put glue on uh, and then I also have my makeup brush uh, cleaner things that my boyfriend got me. I can't remember for what. I think it's for Christmas or something. Uh, and yeah, and also this. I've done a video on uh, this cleaner. It's pretty good, but I say what uh, the issues are with it in the video. Then I've just got uh, this, uh, their real mascara. This is for my friend whenever she uh, does her makeup here. I just keep it for her uh, so that she can do it because she doesn't wear makeup. But when she does, she normally gets it done here or does it here and then she uses this. Uh, then I got, I've done a video on these as well. They're the magnetic eyelashes. Uh, so yeah, I've done a review on them too. Uh, then I've just got some cotton buds in here. And yeah, and then I just have like a few like lip plumper, like eye things and some creams uh samples here so that was all of my makeup collection and also kind of like my hair care i hope that you enjoyed watching this video i know i love to watch like makeup collections just to see like what other people have and how they have it stored and everything like i find it really interesting so i hope you enjoyed this video as always i will see you in my next video bye